We begin tonight in Fulton County. One town in the region is expecting a boost in tourism this summer, and they expect that wave to begin this weekend. Northeast Arkansas News' Sarah Doan has the story. I'm here in Fulton County where the kickoff to Memorial Day is officially underway. I spoke with one business who says they expect a larger turnout this year in tourism compared to last year's holiday weekend. Yes, we are under expecting a big crowd this weekend. I think from the phone calls and running out of rafts earlier than normal, yes, we are. While many islands camp did feel some of the low tourism and economic impact of the pandemic last year, Wood believes they still had a decent season, thanks to families spending more time outside and exploring the area. The Spring River is normally packed with tourists on holiday weekends. Wood knew that trend would continue this year, as all their rafts are rented out for the weekend. We ran out a little earlier than what we normally do, and um, usually it's Friday, kind of late afternoon before we do. We ran out yesterday, so. It was a little earlier than expected. Getting a jump on their weekend, some Memorial Day tourists started to arrive yesterday, including North Mississippi visitor Lee Miller, who is spending the holiday weekend in a cabin on the river with friends. Now both Wood and Miller say they are looking forward to seeing people back on the river. It's nice to be out and um, we're hoping it's going to be a busy weekend. We get to see a lot of people. It's great that we don't have to wear a mask. Um, we're all back out and getting to be around our friends again and um, we're hoping to see to sit and people watch and watch how much people come down the river. We're really excited and I think everybody else is really excited too to be out out in nature and now this is not only isolated to many islands. I spoke with a few other businesses in Hardy and at the Spring River and they say they expect a large turnout this weekend as well. Sarah Doe, Northeast Arkansas News, Fulton County.